Welcome everybody, my name is James and I've been reselling on eBay for over 20 years. I sell over 2,000 items a month. So during this video, make sure you comment below on your favorite item sold. Don't forget to like, subscribe and all that jive and let's get to pulling some orders. As we start the final video for the Sunday pulling orders, we will start here with the new arrivals. That's part of a lot, so we'll get to that in a minute. And then we've got ballroom original Broadway cast cassette promo gold stamped, sold for five fifty. And then we also have what I decided to do is I'm always talking about those. Um, all those CDs I got from the Hastings, and I got so many of them. So I made a 30 CD lot of sealed new CDs, and I was able to make 10 of these lots with the same artist in them. And I sold two to one person that didn't make it on video. Sometimes I forget or skip, or for some reason something doesn't make it on video. Uh, so I sold two to one person the other day, and then another one just sold today. So 30 CDs sold for uh, $15. And I averaged uh, 10 cents a piece paying for them, so at three bucks. All right, Trevor Wilbury's cassette sold for a quick $5. Stronger. This cool cork hat sold for $10. They had a busy day. They're going to sleep good tonight. <laughs> Goofy kids. Oh, and we got a little shocker coming up. And I won't tell you nothing more than that. Not really a shocker. Well, shocker, but not a shocker. But you'll, you'll, you'll see what I mean. Five, four, three, two, one. Are you ready for a hat lot? Yeah. All right. Here's the... Other hat that went with the new arrival hat, two Vineyard Vines hats, sold for $21. All right, Told the Wet Sprocket Fear cassette, sold for a quick five bucks. All right, Crime and the City Solution CD, sold for doo -doo -doo. quick five bucks. Charlie Door cassette. Sold for seven bucks. So we got our jeweled St. Louis Cardinals hat. Sold for ten bucks. Sorry, nine dollars. Now I believe that comes a time when everything just falls in line. We live and learn from our mistakes. The deepest cuts are... That's probably my favorite Pat Benatar song. This CD sold for quick five dollars. The Love's Truck Stop, which have taken over America. Uh, hat sold for $8. We're looking for Miss Braxton. Tony Braxton. Where are you? Miss Braxton. Calling Miss Braxton. You're wanted up front. I am blind again or I messed up. It was hidden from me. Move that. And then there's two of them here. And so for a quick five dollars. Alright. Oh, and if you remember, we sold another one of these the what, a week ago or so. One of the CDs I picked up on the golf trip. The golf thrip thrift trip. God it's hard to say that. <laughs> Uh, it's live in the studio songs on radio stations. These type of CDs usually do pretty well. Um, there was one, was it K-Fog? They used to sell a lot of back in the early 2000s on eBay. K-Fog, different volumes. And of them, some of them were harder to get than others. You could get over 100 bucks a piece for some of them. Um, this one sold for $50. Frankie Lane, Greatest Hits cassette, sold for a quick $5. Extra, extra, hear all about it. Vinyl, sold for a quick $5. <laughs> and 
there. It's tired. All right, E65, we're going for a little Rod Stewart. Infatuation, infatuation. That song's not on here. That song's newer than this CD. Uh, sold for a quick $5. Villanona Wildcats. Hat sold for $10 going to Australia. I need some of that again. All right. We were just looking for this right here. Stormy Weekend, Mystic Moods. Album sold for $5. A little SpongeBob hat. Sold for $10 going up to Canada. All right. Hearts Greatest Hits Live on cassette. Sold for $7. All right, Christy Lumber hat sold for eighteen dollars. Right, Travis Tritt Country Club CD sold for five dollars. All right, another one of those Hastings CDs, Chameleon Late Summer Two K Five CD sold for six dollars. Best of Mountain Stage Volume Three cassette sold for five dollars. All right, Florissant United Soccer Club. Jacket's been in the store forever. Clearance down to six bucks out the door. All right, we got these little mini Grants Farm saucer and cup sold for eight dollars. We got a pair of Converse that sold for ten dollars. All right, now we're gonna get to the final piece, and it's been laying in front of you the whole time. They want to participate but you gotta get out of my way. <laughs> All right, this piece right here is supposed to be in a new video coming up, but I didn't make the video yet because we've got three videos this Sunday, so I didn't feel like making another one. And that is the Honey Hole Volume 5 video, but I did list a few of the items. This one being one of them. We got a Sony Super Audio CD 5 disc carousel. And paid ten dollars for this one piece and it sold for sixty four dollars so we already almost made almost all the money back we spent on uh the last honey hole volume five which you have not seen yet which i have not made yet <laughs> but uh that's a good thing because that's money in the bargain that means i can go back soon so gotta get this shipped and be done for the night right kitties right And for stereo equipment, boom, Chewy Boxes are lifesavers. So you helped me out. And all you're eating, mister. <laughs> You're so tired. All right. You ready to go? He's like, I just followed you back down. You guys ready? You ready to call it a night? At least down here, of course. Stretch. All right, let's go. Say bye. Say see you tomorrow.